Were your caterpillars very hungry, just like in Eric Carle's story? Yeah! Through outdoor learning and outdoor education, children are experiencing the world around them firsthand. When you're reading a story to a child and you're trying to explain a theory like, say, weather, for example, say you're trying to help them understand wind, when you are outside and the children can feel the wind, it makes much more sense to them and it's, it comes to life. And being able to see the subtle changes of nature allows the children to then learn how to become more observant and become scientists. So the outdoor-based movement is a global movement that started in Germany and it's growing. It's something that um, we're just starting to see and UD is on the edge of um, incorporating this into our teaching and our undergraduates are getting to learn about different ways of teaching and different philosophies of teaching and this is an opportunity that they have that they wouldn't see in many universities. The University of Delaware is so different than any other university I've ever heard of. I had friends who are also education majors um, at different universities and they when I tell them about University of Delaware's program, they are shocked when I tell them we do outdoor learning and they're all inside the classroom learning. Every child has their own tree stump like to sit on. Lessons are taught outside. They're outside no matter what the weather is like. Um, so I think that's really cool that we have these different resources here. It's been really eye-opening for the students to see how much more learning can occur when you're outside versus inside. Um, even watching simultaneously that aha moment of those bright eyes that can occur with the young children but then with the big kids as well because they're really noticing, oh wait, I can talk about spring and I can talk about flowers blooming and I can talk about buds on trees, but to really be able to walk down that trail and look at a bud and dissect a bud and figure out what is inside of it and what's going to come from it, it gets really really neat to watch that. I had so much fun with the caterpillars.